Hey you guys, so it's time for another video and today I'm going to be showing you all of my hair products that I have currently. Now those of you who've been following me for a while and watch my vlogs, you know that my family moved into an apartment. God, it's been working on three months now, yay, um, in preparation to move back to Texas. So in the midst of all of that, I had to do some major decluttering. I mean major so being a natural hair youtuber i accumulated let me adjust the camera um being a natural hair youtuber i accumulated quite a bit of products and at one point um i had 300 plus i brought that down to like 100 between 150 and 175 products and i bought over to the apartment about 150 products um, within a month of being here, I said, I gotta get rid of this stuff because there is no way I'm going to take all this stuff to Texas. This is just too much. So I got rid of about a hundred products. I have here a little under 50. So we're going to go over everything that I kept. Okay. We're going to try to do this in order of, I'm going to try to put them in categories like cleansing products deep conditioning, styling products, and I'm going to be including everything in the description box because I like to go, when I'm looking at a video, and especially if it's a hair video and you're talking about products, I want to know what they are. So I'm gonna take the time and list everything that I'm going over in the description box. A good 90% of the products you're gonna see, I have an actual formal review on, okay? Let's get started. So we have ORS Olive Oil Creamy Aloe Shampoo, okay, made with aloe vera. Now I think I have a complete wash day video on using um, products from the ORS line, all right? Next up we have Eden Body Works Peppermint Tea Tree Natural Shampoo. I don't have a review on this. Um, and this is actually the very first time that I've used this particular product and it's okay. It's all right. We have um, Cream of Nature's Pure Honey Moisturizing Dry Defense Shampoo. I got this at, I know this is not like, there we go. So I got this at Sally's. I was acting a fool online at Sally's and just purchased a bunch of products. And this was one of them. Um, pure honey rich coconut oil. Now see, why, why didn't I see that? I don't know why I didn't see that. Coconut oil. I'm trying to stay away from coconut oil, you guys. So pure honey rich coconut oil, creamy shade butter. But this guy mixed reviews so I'm gonna go ahead and try it okay moving on we have the cream of nature with argan oil from Morocco the moisture and shine shampoo absolutely love okay trust amaze flawless curls we have the um, shampoo and the conditioner this conditioner is bomb.com I actually did like a complete series of comparing drugstore um, conditioners I'm gonna be linking that in the card so that you guys can check that out okay we have swabs daily clarifying shampoo this is my go-to clarifying shampoo let's see if that'll zoom in I know what swab look like now swab is undergoing some changes with their packaging so I was really excited when I went into Walmart the other day and I was like oh my god swab got a lot of new products no they don't girl they just change the packaging I guess you got some money now so they change <laughs> let me stop continuing on with swab we have their tropical coconut nourishing conditioner whenever I go into the Dollar Tree which is like once a week I just grab one of these because I use this to pre put my hair, detangle my hair, which is basically pre point for me. And I will go through an entire jar of this on wash day. So, yeah. Um, I have two new products by Swab. They're from their Luscious Curls line. We have their sulfate free shampoo and we have their conditioner. Um, let's see if that'll zoom in. 
all right i will be doing a formal review on these these are quite big what are these 16.5 ounces moving on to vo5 from the moisture milk is this moisture milk no it's not um the strawberries and cream with soy milk moisturizing conditioner now i know some of you guys can't get vo5 in certain countries and i'm so sorry girl all right so we have that let's move these all down the line let's jump to deep conditioners and mask okay we have african prides moroccan clay and shea butter detox and soften heat activated mask and yeah this was part of the stuff i got from sally's because it was on sale so i was like why not we have ors hair mayonnaise at least one hair mayonnaise, hair mayonnaise on deck and i prefer the one by ors as opposed to the african pride one for me personally we have eden body works natural deep conditioner you guys saw me use this recently in my last hair related video and then we have another cholesterol i love cholesterols we have blue magic cholesterols conditioning blue magic cholesterol conditioning rinse now i saw my girl nancy naps sorry something fell i saw my girl nancy naps use this product and i was like oh me won't i won't so yeah i got this yes 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 so review of this is coming fairly soon okay so let's go into leave-in conditioners or leave-ins and then we have stylers which is next that's that's the most over there yeah <laughs> we have Camille Rose honey hydrate now this is a sticky sticky it's like honey to the point where my husband was upset why I had honey in the bathroom I'm like child first okay anyway so this is great for for me personally I only use this on my twist meaning my hair is already in twist because it could be like a sticky mess if you use too much, okay? We have an oldie but goodie, the Cantu Shea Moisture Leave-In Conditioning Repair Cream. We have the Blue Magic Argan Oil Herbal Complex. I have a formal review on this, love it. I went back to this. I, I don't know why I, I neglected you all this time, Giovanni. I'm so sorry. Giovanni Direct Leave-In Weightless Moisture Conditioner. Well, let, me, let me tell you something. This is a little pricier out of all of the conditioners I use, but it is definitely worth it. I'm going back to the tried but true products and the Giovanni Direct Leave-In Conditioner, which I do purchase on Amazon, is it for me, okay? Love this stuff. Um, olive oil. It's ORS olive oil um, hair lotion made with castor oil. It's okay, but it's a thick conditioner, which is why I like it. We have Kinky Tresses Avocado Infusion Hair Milk, which is, you know, I like it because she's black owned. And yeah, love it. Another black owned company is Cryo Botanicals Leave In Conditioner. Um, protein free with veggies and herbs provides hydration and moisture pH of 4.5 on her website they can be a bit pricey I will say that okay let's let that zoom in some sorry y'all all right and last but not least we have girl um this product right here y'all this product will have you smelling like you ride horses you play hockey uh you got a wood wood deck in the back and um yeah you got a hairy chest and, and you drink you drink crown royal yeah that's what this is so i give this to jb i let him you know i <laughs> he uses i put this on his hair because it's very very fragrant and it smells like a man okay it smells like a man so he can walk around like i said in the review in the review he can walk around smelling like a 50 year old man who drinks two uh who smokes two packs of whatever so all right you guys so let's go into my styling products and just random other products and this is the most sorry y'all that i have all right so we have look i was not playing when it came to this particular product they have discontinued, which i may write a letter to sally's this is the generic curl defining cream which was just basically the dupe for Shea Moisture's 
curl enhancing smoothie but to be honest this is better than the curl enhancing smoothie in my opinion and so this is from sally's part of the generic value product line they discontinued this and they started selling it for like four dollars and then i saw it for like two for five. Oh, i went in there almost every day and just i just got all of them at one point i had like five of them um and now i'm back to my last one but that's okay we have apogee's keratin and green tea reconstructor spray which i absolutely love this is one of the few products that i used to use while relaxed that i still use now that i am natural let me go ahead and spray some of this on i haven't used this in like two weeks all right we have design design essentials sent me a couple of products like a while back and i kept it so we have their honey curl forming custard we have their almond and avocado curl enhancing mousse uh this is all right i mean it's not like yeah it's okay it's Basically, I have another mousse that I prefer over that. All right, we have Eden Body Works Curl Defining Cream. And you know what? I don't think I've ever reviewed this product, so let me know if you're into I don't, maybe I have by Eden Body Works. And I feel like it's okay. I feel like for 4B, if you're four type, you're gonna need a little bit more hold, in my opinion. You may need this to go with it. Echo styling, you already know what it is. I use that to achieve this wash and go that I have now. I don't know what I use for a leave-in for this particular. I think I use can too. Yeah, you you actually worked for a change. Thank you. Um, y'all, I know I'm silly. All right, so we have the moisture milk, African pride, hydrate and strengthen leave-in cream. This cheap, I'm just gonna say what it is. It makes you question how great the products are, but not bad. But these are actually not bad at all. Everything from the African Pride um, line, this particular line, has been pretty good. Proclaim Glossing Polish, whenever I'm brave enough to flat iron my hair, this is what I use as a serum. We have the Curls Cream Brulee with Curl Cream. I don't know why I have this. I clearly don't use it. I don't know why I have it. Quite a bit of this is in here. And um, to be honest, there's not a lot of products that I care from the Curls line. But every now and then I see it. If it's like $4, I'll get it. Because put it like this, it works. But I have other products that work even better. So, okay. Wonder Curl, hey Scarlett. <laughs> She's the owner of Wonder Curl. Wonder Curl sent me some products. We have her sealing her hair butter. I love the new packaging, Scarlett. And we have the Get Set Hair Jelly. So I use these products together for a twist out. And I really think next I want to do a braid out. Um, like a curly braid out using these products. Maybe if it gets cool, if it, if it finally can, can cool down here in Phoenix, we'll see. Kinky Tresses, we have her hair butter. Absolutely love this stuff. Some of the best, best, best styling butter that I've used. Her, okay, this is bad. This is the, this was her old um, packaging and this is the new packaging. We have mango, is there even anything in here, girl? Oh, there's a little bit. So by Cryo Botanicals, let's get what we have from that line. What is this? Okay, Vivian. So apparently I have three hair butters by Kinky Trust. Hey, I, clearly I support her. So by Cryo Botanicals, we have her mango twist and braid. Again, I believe this is for low porosity mostly. Um, not a lot is left in here. Is this the same thing? What's the difference between the mango twist and braid and the mango twist and curl? Mango twist and curl. Y'all, I'm talking to myself. And this was a product that Walgreens used to sell locally and it was bang. We have the curling curl cream. 
And I do like that you can purchase this locally, okay? And I do have a separate video on this. So by the Curls ID line that's sold exclusively at Sally's Beauty, we have the Twist Butter. Now y'all, I am pretty sure that they have came out with other collections. Um, I actually had about five products by so Texture ID and I ended up, I did end up giving those away. So my go-to wrap me when I wanna go to bed with 100 perm rocks in my head is by a lot about it, a lot about it. Where's my curl and style milk? Did I give that away? Oh no, I gave that away. Oh yeah, we should never have done that. So y'all, <laughs> I'm talking to myself. Um, so yeah, I had the curling style milk, so I must have been feeling very um, generous that day and I gave that away with a lot, a lot of other stuff clearly. But the Wrap Me Foaming Mousse is to me one of the best mousse two products or by TGIN, my girl Chris Tia. We have the TGIN Buttercream Daily Moisturizer and then we have the TGIN Twist and Define Cream. The thing about the TGIN products, you guys, a little bit goes a long way. I know that some people either hate it or love it. For me personally, I prefer the Buttercream over the Twist and Define Cream, but I always support my girl because when she first came out, I um, was one of the few um youtubers that was actually reviewing her products that is it you guys those are all of the products that i am keeping i'm not i would say the only thing that i have coming in and it's one of y'all's fault it's one of y'all's fault because i use the eden body works deep conditioner and one of you, you know who you are Okay, so that is it, you guys. Thank you so much for watching, and thank you as always to all of my new subscribers. Take care. Bye.